Hi guys, welcome back for another one. We're continuing here Transport Fever 2, our Apex Challenge. Every product to every city. And as promised at the end of the episode, uh, we're going to deliver more goods to our North End Depot to be distributed uh, to more cities. More cities uh, or an improvement to cities. Probably more of an improvement than more. Uh, but we could add Carlsbad. Getting ahead of myself. Getting ahead of myself. Uh, I'm thinking about all the things I thought about off camera and now I'm paying for it. Anyways, uh, let's go ahead and get started here. So... Off camera, I did check the roll back and checked all the rates and uh, let some time roll off. Uh, I had to fix up the trains a little bit. They, once again, it, it seems like what I'm seeing the most of is that though, uh, when I upgrade the trains, the rates are actually lower than what they're going to be when they settle. Um, so I've had it somewhere I had to trim, trim back on some more wagons when it came to these lines and trim more back when it came to even the steel that delivered in as it was way overrated. Uh, I did take a look at my cash. It looks like for the most part, we got our railroad in line. I'm not quite sure where this came from. Um, let me see, maintenance, tickets. Um, we did sell quite a bit less uh, ticket-wise in railroads, uh, but everything else seemed pretty stable. Um, so I think it's just a, a frequency issues every other, like every other year, I think. Keep an eye on it, but it does look like for the most part, we have that number a little bit better fixed than what we used to have. Um, a couple episodes, maybe like a week or so ago, we had a lot of money issues or loss of money issues when it came to trains. I want to keep upgrading this line real quick because we get, to deliver more goods. I need to fix the uh, the frequency rate. And currently, if you guys are curious what the frequency 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 rate is, uh, goods to North End is only two seventy two, uh, as shown. Just double check, show double show you guys here. We should be producing 400, so we want our rate to... Actually, our rate does not actually need to be 400. Because um, some of them will go straight here for Inglewood. So we actually don't need an exact 400 rate. Um, and actually, we only need like a 200 rate. Um, that's going to be tough to measure. That's going to be real tough to measure. I mean, I could do the the greedy thing and it's going to be easier to measure is have is cancel all this have goods go and all be delivered at depot and then come and then come back and be delivered up here but i kind of like the idea of having other goods come down here like i think we do have right goods is supposed to i mean you're supposed to bring back something i'm pretty sure you're supposed to bring back something uh, brick or food you should be, you should be coming back with it. either way we can take a look at it here in a little bit I got to rename the train so it's I know by just looking at it that needs to be what it needs to be actually are you already all upgraded no way no way no way how is this already oh it doesn't have the cannery I was like home there's no way it was fully upgraded it just doesn't have the cannery got it uh, also known as the electrical lines. It doesn't have them. So that's all we're really upgrading here is putting the electrical lines in, which is very expensive. Um, I really want to check out the Peterbilt, um, a road vehicle that we, that we got last time. I really want to check it out to see exactly what the rate and speed is on it. To upgrade this platform. It really is annoying how these can't be upgraded as easily as the rest of the roads. Yeah. I think I, I I've been debating here I was upgrading this trains exactly how I wanted to handle this this route. I think what I'm going to do is I'm just going to make it down to one train. Not what I wanted. Uh, North End Depot. All right, what are you? Yeah, you're full. Yo, you're way full. Where are you at? All right, let's let you get in there because we're going to delete you. You're probably going to pick stuff up, which is going to suck. Actually, let me see if I can pause it right as it drops stuff off. Because I think this train's supposed to pick up food. Could be wrong, but I believe it's supposed to pick up some food. All 
Alright, you made your money. Now delete. Alright. Alright, so what we want to do here is... Back, 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 back. Alright, so we're walking with a 1, 2... Alright, so 6 is to 40 meters. Uh, once again, guys, this is how I measure how big my trains could be. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Darn it. I guess I could upgrade this way. This way would probably be simpler. All right, let's do it this way. All right, so we shouldn't have to back up too far. All right, let's just go ahead and add these in. Come on. Platform. All right, let's put these back up. And uh, I'm going to be honest with you guys, I did not pay that close of attention. Uh, so I can't remember which ones need to be bridged off. Which line's broken? Oh, quite a few of them. Oh, darn it. Darn, this, um, this is terrible. I really should have paid close. Okay, hold on. Come on. If, I, if I put a cross pattern here, how much does that fix? All right, do that. How much does that fix? Did not fix as much as I'd hope it did. <laughs> um, all right, so let's do this. Have you cross? Uh, well, if that's all you're going to give me, that's what I'll take. All right, double slip switch. Double slip switch. Did I get that one? No. All right, so that should have fixed all of them. What? Why are you guys all using this platform? Uh, how about some of you terminals? All right. How about you use three? There we go. At least uh, get a little bit of variety going on there. Holy smokes. All right. Uh, so everything's fixed. Everything's at high speed and they're at two. 40. All right. Next thing to do is good. So North End Depot, uh, we're gonna manage this vehicle. All right. Upgrade you. Give me one of my favorites. And we need to deliver goods. All right, so have you at that? Let's go ahead, replace. And let's go ahead and let, let's put on the fastest speed because what I want to see exactly what's my damage here on the rate. It's got, it has to be better than 225. There's no way it's 225. It has to be better than 225. I'm um, gonna give some time to settle. There's no way that's 225. It has to be better. There we go. Look at it it's shooting like a rocket compared to the other one, uh, which reminds me we gotta make sure we get all this other stuff on these routes upgraded. Um, yeah, it's just going. I mean, I just love. I love how fast this one is. There's 120. Oof. There you go. You're gonna drop off all your box goods. You're gonna pick up. Should we picking up food? Yeah, we're just gonna get a ton of it, but we are getting some food, which is great. All right, so at least that part of the journey works out. Uh, auto save holding in there. I don't really, don't think I really need to watch this for anything else out of care, other than curiosity. Oh 
Nice, nice corner of the bridge. Love it, love it. Alright. I'm actually just curious. We're going to watch this a little bit. We haven't watched the train in a while. I really just want to watch this one because, one, I do feel like this will be a narrow. We might have some choke points that we might need to address. But I would really like to get some other tool or other things going into Inglewood. Because I think Ingle, Inglewood, I'm pretty sure, is demanding all six goods at this point. So there's what I'm worried about. Oh, Steel's at the faster, so we only pass Steel. That's what I'm worried about. That train right there. I think that's oil. That's fuel. All right, that's what I'm worried about. Fuel. Come on, break off from you. Let's go slow speed. What are you? Yeah, you are what I'm concerned about. So you go fuel to Inglewood. You. It's ready for me to see. Manage vehicle. I really just want to see this vehicle's line. I think, are you picking up? So you're picking up and delivering from there. I could always, if I get a good enough rate on this, I could always like replace the last two tank, like the last two cars. Um, and put a fuel tank on it and get rid of that train altogether. Um, what is my rate? Oh, it's still holding 225. Uh, it's not what I, not ideal. But I think, I think, guys, I think we're going to do that in this episode. I really do think I'm going to do that. Um, yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna, we're, we're, yeah, we're doing it. We're doing it. We're doing it. We're doing it. We're gonna, we're gonna get rid of fuel altogether. Um, yeah, and we're not getting rid of it. We're just gonna re, uh, replace it. But let's first let's upgrade this road because this is a really really old road. Uh, let's see here. Two country road, two lanes. I probably should be doing four at this point, but you know, we'll see. <laughs> All right, so the country road. All right, so if we have. That looks really residential there. Um, interesting. All right. So I think what we're going to do here is we're going to fix this up. Um, configure. Cargo. All right. What I want to do here. Is I have goods in Inglewood. All right, so we're gonna uh, we're gonna try to get a little cute with this. Um, goods. All right, good place to drop off goods is. I wish there was a way to get better way of seeing all this. Um, all right, I really want goods to drop off like right there. So that's going to be the goods line. All right. We're going to do a little micromanagement here. So first off, this is, this is a getting down to the micromanagement part of the game. So for the goods for Inglewood, first off, we're going to manage these vehicles and we are going to upgrade them. Cargo, cargo. There we go. Peterbilt. Oh, Peterbilt. 
All right, I don't think this is practical for inner city routes, but this is definitely going to become practical for some other stuff. Um, yeah, really good. I can't wait to see what we get for permanent game. All right, so anyways, let's go. All right, delivering goods, goods it is. Mission 71. Eh, all right. All right, so we need, so I look at this, the goods line, goods bring in 140. So 181 is its max. I don't know if we can produce that much. Let me see, 181. Oh my goodness. Okay, let's delete some of these guys. All right, delete one, got me that. Delete me two. All right, I should be able to delete another one. All right, good enough. All right, so you guys, let me go manage this, manage this line. Actually, before we do that, let's add in the food line. Um, so what I wanna do is I find a stop for food. Oh, Ingwood actually only demands four. Oh, all right. Food, focus, focus, focus. All right, Ingwood. No, no, wrong menu. There we go. Food is located. I think food's located here because of how I was delivering. Um, let's do food there. Delete this stuff. I don't think I need this stuff anymore. Yep, nothing broke. All right, so we're delivering food there. So new line. And cool, you're using the other platforms. Exactly what I wanted you to do. Um, I don't remember. I should have really wrote down a cheat code for all this stuff. All right, is this Glenda or this is Inglewood? All right, so we are Inner city, Ingle, Inglewood, food, delivery. All right, what I want to do is just buy one truck. Oh, I see how that deal is spelled a little differently. Food delivery. Food delivery surely would be a different color. Can I get that? Can I get you in a different color? There we go. All right. So now what I want to do now that both these lines are recognized, I want to, all right, first off with this line, I want to manage line. All right. So this is Inglewood halt. I think I should rename it. Um, uh, we're going to call it the goods depot. Uh, I really hate that there's a goods called goods in this game because I really, I mean, to me, it's all, everything that we do is goods, but uh, Goods Depot, go Wood. All right. So what I want to do is censor this. So we, do, we only want to load goods and we don't want to unload anything. And then here we just want to unload goods. There we go. That's how we want the line. Now the other line and it's line. We want to, I just want to, we only want to load food. We don't want to unload anything. And then in ninth street, we want to just unload food. And this is how we keep things from being cross contaminated. So when this train brings back food, it should go into the second line where it's delivered on its own little platform. Um, Food line is 41. We are working with 51, which is fine. Actually, I could, I could put a second one on. I will, I will. I'll put a, I'll put a second one on. Manage vehicles. Uh, it's gonna be a little bit of an overkill, but that's fine. All right, so next up is fuel. We want fuel to come back through here. Ooh, new train. Don't know if you're cheaper or more expensive. All right. 
so we're gonna go ahead so fuel is a commercial good no no fuel is an industrial good this is com i wish they'd lay these out a little better so it's a so it's a commercial good and it's located up here i believe we're using that for one for fuel yes we are all right so we're going to create our own little line here and since it's commercial um actually these guys should be on the same platform terminals you should be on terminal one all right um we are going to for the time being what we're going to do here is we're going to take this line manage line after all this is done we're going to go add station we're going to come down here we gotta put that on two then and we're going to come back up to here all right looks messy it's fine we just need this line recognized for fuel we can fix it up later terminals you terminal two all right so we have commercial goods industrial goods kind of how i want it broken down all right and so there's already vehicles on here let's go ahead and upgrade those vehicles uh we'll we'll, tr we'll trim them back delete them later uh, update to we need one for fuel there we go all right, so now what we're going to do here is we're going to configure. Nope, wrong thing. We're going to look for okay, goods line. All right, we're, first off, we're going to rename this. Um, goods to North End Depot. Ingle Wood Delivery. A little bit of a long one, but hopefully, I'll make it out something. Um, that can figure this one out. So what we're going to do is we're going to manage these vehicles. We're going to get a little ugly with it. <laughs> um, so let's go ahead. We're going to duplicate. I mean, there's not a depot found. There's a depot right up here. Why wouldn't, why wouldn't this work? I'm confused why I said no depot found. Uh, this is a depot right here to me, buddy. No depot found? Are you serious? Huh. All right. And I'll just make another one. All right. So we're going to do is, oh, that's actually, when do you disappear? Oh, you're about ready to disappear on me. That kind of Oh, no, no, never mind. We're this one right here. Oof. Oh, actually, that new locomotive that came out. What do you do? You're cheaper. You max out 105. Um, yeah. Now I kind of wish I wouldn't just want max speed. Um, it is what it is. All right. So you are doing all this good stuff for me. You are 240. There we are. So what I want to do is I want to trim you back. So if I turn you back to you hold 36. We probably could do more than 36. Let's go ahead. One, two, three. So that way you can bring back fuel with you also. Boom. And you need to go on that line. You're missing like Oh, this is probably what the issue was. Hold me. I can swear there's canneries there, but I'll double check. Track. Uh, there, I mean, there's another electronic or electric train. So I don't understand what the problem is. If I delete your depot. Oh my goodness. Del Everything's difficult. I'm trying to end this episode. You're being difficult. All right. Yes. Slow the vehicle. Delete. I put a new depot on because apparently that's the way I got to go now. High speed cannery. Yes. I guess this is what I got to do. 
All right, now buy the same thing again. Now I'm getting frustrated because now the episode's going to run long. <laughs> All right, let's go. All right, 240. All right, so let's delete three. Add three tank cars. There we go. That fixed my problem. There we go. And let's go ahead and we'll find the other vehicle, which is actually right there. Oh, which is probably going to hate me for doing this, but it's fine. As well fix itself out in the long term. There we go. And that way you can bring fuel back with you. And where is my nice little fuel vehicle? It's still running a Mongol. All right, you are running empty. Uh, good night, buddy. You are sold and gone. All right, this line, manage line. Goodbye. You no longer exist. And that simplifies the tracks even more. I love simplifying tracks. All right, and then this one should go over here. Ooh. Wow, it just jumped 300 some fuel right on over. That's that's dangerous. <laughs> that's real dangerous. All right, guys, that's where we're going to wrap up this episode. We're going to catch this train right here. Come on. No, not the other train. Thank you. Wrap this video up. Um, all right, guys, that's going to do it for this one. Uh, where we go from here, who knows what's next. I'll take a look at some things to see what we want to jump into next. Lots and lots of upgrading to do. And we're still 28 years away from um, the end game phase of connecting every good to every city. Um, but we're still laying down the foundation work to make it happen. So guys, before you go, do me a huge favor. Hit that thumbs up button. Subscribe if you haven't done so already. Don't forget to leave me a comment and turn on the notification bell. And I'll catch you guys on the next one. Bye.